Hey, what's up guys? Steve Kuklo here. Um, get some off-season, post-Olympia, post-European uh, Tour training today. As you can see, I've uh, been eating a little bit and uh, putting on some weight. And it's been a fun, fun month and a half of my life. I mean, I've been having a time in my life just traveling, getting to see the world and, uh, you know, meeting a ton of fans getting out and, and competing with the best in the world and to be able to get on stage with these guys and, uh, and hang and, and bring it, you know, what is my best package today has been, it's been awesome. And uh, the biggest thing I think that I've taken from this is, is kind of the motivating factor of being up there, you know, getting comparisons with the top guys like Dennis and Dexter and Sean and, and Roly and those guys and being able to get compared in the, in the top five of those um, it's, it's been been absolutely incredible, and, and it's like I'm really on cloud nine, but enjoying right now some downtime as far as doing uh, a ton of cardio and, and dieting. But I still enjoy training. You know, I'm kind of transitioning into um, my off-season training. Yeah, I may be hitting only just a couple days a week right now. You know, as far as like you know, the total downtime or coming off not training at all. I think for my own sanity, I like to train. And today, um, you'll see a little bit. I, I still lift heavy a little bit. I threw around some 170s in uh, some dumbbell inclines and today. Um, but I feel good. I, if, I, if I was sore, if I was beat up, I, I wouldn't do it. And I'm just kind of go based on how I feel. Move, that's strong. Uh, uh, no. uh, three. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, takes up so calories are up my weight's up I'm only up maybe about 10 pounds from where I competed so it's not like I'm you know 30 pounds up can barely breathe and uh, you know have cankles but <laughs> I mean right now uh, I hold my condition I'm doing a lot of guest posing so I've, you know I've been traveling a lot so I mean I've only been a few times it feels like a few days a week I'm in Dallas I worked yesterday at the fire department and you know 24 hours I get off and got a ton of stuff to catch up on so it, I guess this life of uh, having two professions but it's been going really good I, I can't complain I'm blessed and and it's uh, it's really good I'm, I'm uh, you know looking forward to what tw uh, 2015 has to bring I mean uh, I haven't decided what I want to do yet but as far as uh, I'm gonna sit down with my team this coming week I'm gonna be in Dallas for a few weeks where I have some you know no traveling I get to enjoy life a little bit and I'm gonna kind of plan out 2015 you know, the Arnold is something to look into. It might be a little bit um, tight on time. You know, it doesn't allow me a lot off season. So it's going to be potentially the Arnold, but I don't know. I can't say. So we're going to we're going to figure some things out. See how much time I need. How much uh, you know? I need to bring my weight up. Ideally, I want to get to three or, or three hundred or, or more um, at a good weight, not not sloppy and. Uh, We'll see what, what comes of it. You know, it's going to take a lot of food, a lot of icon meals that I'll be pounding, and uh, you know, a lot of uh, a lot of hard training. And that's kind of that's 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 what does it. You know, it's not it's not uh, one magic pill or anything. It's just hard work every day. You know, and even in off season, it's going to take consistency with my food and my training to get there. And you'll see. You know, today um, in my off season, I just you know I back my volume down a little bit. I'm not doing like 18 to 20 sets. I'm doing more. You know, 14 sets, a um, little bit heavier weight. Um, you know, not so high paced, and my food is up. So that all together is really what kind of will help slowly bring my weight up. I like to slowly do things, transition. I still do cardio right now. I'm still gonna, you know, I, I'm a big fan of the health aspect. You know, you got to be healthy. For me, uh, you know, I, I can't. It, uh, for me, it, it's all about the longevity. It's not about just how big I can get, how quick and. You know, I'm still young, 29. I got a lot of years in this, so I appreciate all your guys' support and, and you know following me and you know the positive uh, feedback I've gotten over the last few weeks with all the shows and you know finishing second at Finland was uh, was awesome. The way to finish the European tour for me, and uh, I look forward to doing that one again next year and many years to come. And uh, you know, 2015 is going to be exciting. So look forward to getting a lot of training with you guys and everybody that follows me. I, truly appreciate you and 
you know, keep up with me on, on my website, speedcouplo.com. You know, a lot of cool stuff coming out with my apparel and different things I'm working on, and you know, uh, uh, all the social media, Facebook and Instagram. I try to keep up on that as much as possible, and you know, all my sponsors with Evagen and uh, Icon Meals and uh, Skin Technologies, and everybody that does sponsor me. It's uh, it's incredible. And I thank you guys, and so looking forward uh, to what the future has to bring. So. This is Steve Kuklo with MD, killing a little off-season training. You'll see a little uh, how pumped we got from, uh, we did a little deli news breakfast this morning, so that's that's why the chest got so ridiculous was the uh, the French toast and the uh, pancakes I had for breakfast. <laughs> Good stuff. I appreciate you guys, and we'll see you guys soon.